It's a gorgeous sunny day here in San Diego. Thank you so much for tuning in to List It Live, where we give you a guided tour of the hottest homes for sale in San Diego. I have Brandon Rampani joining me with another fantastic listing, and I'm so excited to talk about it. I got another one. Let's do it. This is a good one. Okay. I, this is one of my favorite ones right now. Okay. Anytime that you can lock in four beds into the Poway School District, yeah. That's all I got to say. I know. Poway Unified is top notch. Let's just talk about Poway Unified for one second. Let's okay, do it. We'll talk about the house in a second, but I think just the school zone makes this house valuable. When you have four bedrooms that feed into one of the better, zip, uh, better school districts of San Diego, you tend to have higher rents. You tend to get better gentrification in the area. You tend to get the Costco's in your area. Mm -hmm. You tend to get the newer schools in your area. And that's what this home possesses. I live in the 92127 zip code. The difference between this part of 92127 and my part is that I've got to pay Mellow Roos to keep the streets, the roads, the schools humming and drumming. The beauty of this house is it's able to still piggyback that gentrification and that school district without having to pay the Mellow Roos. Right. This home was built, uh, was built around the 90s. So when it comes to a 90s place, um, I've got to make sure that the HOA is copacetic. We are under 500 here. Um, that does give you pools, community centers. You can see that the um, uh, this particular picture here, you get a lot of open land mm -hmm. in the community, which is rare compared to my last listing. You're not going to get any open uh, open um, areas. Right. So this breathability, if you will, the privacy, the seclusion of Poblado with the four bedrooms, kind of stands this 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 listing out for me. Um, it's got paid off solar, as you can see. The arrow there is pointing to the unit. These are townhomes because you do have a common wall. But what I like about some of these 90s built patio townhomes, if you will, is that the garage entrance comes into the courtyard. So it's not like you park and have to walk to your unit. Mm -hmm. You pull in and then you pull into your beautiful courtyard and then walk into your front door. So it's convenient. Very convenient. Yeah, great for groceries. Or when your kiddos are sleeping at yep. night, you got to carry them in from the car because we know what that's about. Heck yeah. <laughs> Um, That's great. They ran the slate, which is what that material is in the back, from the courtyard through the living room to the back. So when you put the same floor mm -hmm. cohesively through a bottom floor or through a house, and don't tell me where to, a room is demarked because I've changed the flooring there, make it all one flooring, it really does open up the unit. Yeah, it does. It, it well, brings the inside out. So now you essentially have that outdoor living that's like an indoor living feel. Correct. Right. The whole bottom floor is about 1,100 square feet. Okay. And there's no bedrooms on the bottom floor. So that's kind of a... a so a, a lot of great living space. A lot of great for, living, but just if that needs an older person living below that, all the bedrooms are up above the stairs. So okay. that's obviously, you know, the living's down and then the bedrooms are up. Which is great. I like that kind of living for entertaining. That's exactly right. You this know? is such an entertainer's house. Yeah. I'm actually having an open house on this today. Oh, so today? I'm doing a two to four. Okay. Um, kind of an open house. Funny thing here, this picture is kind of reminding me of it. When I showed up to, the, to actually sit at this table to do the listing agreement, right, to get this and everything dialed in, I couldn't even see that pine tree that was in that photo because they had a, an eight foot fence one of my favorite things about this home is that when I walk into that dining room nook area or that backyard, it's got a view. I mean, that pine tree sits down and you're looking at the, basically in the middle of the pine tree. Okay. So there's wow. scaping views of Rancho and the Ramona Mountains all behind that. But when that fence was up, I couldn't you see can, it. So right. I made a small recommendation to the homeowner. Can we cut that fence down to four feet? And he cut it down in the last two weeks and it just opened up the light back there. It opened up the view back there. What a great recommendation. And I think as agents, we've got to make those uh, those those on-the-fly choices. Calls. See what I'm saying? Yes, I, I can now see all there. the way through there how that point-to-point -point yes. slate well, just it, carries through. It's great. It opens up your viewing, which makes it feel like a larger living space, it does. too. It doesn't block it, right? That's exactly like right. Like a, a wall. And more light. More light. More I'm light a huge light in. buff. Yeah, and me luckily, too. they put some can lights in the ceiling Yeah, I was just going to say that recessed lighting is great, too. Really came out well. Um, they haven't done a lot of upgrades to the unit, which is why I'm pricing it at seven ninety nine. That's a great price point for that area of town. They're model match with walls removed and flooring and counters sold for nine forty. Yeah. So if that delta there of showing you what a model match 
uh, can sell for if it's all upgraded. Right. That's $140,000 of breathing room, and I think you can get that place done for that uh, as far as remodeling goes. Yes. You just need some new flooring. We've got overhead lighting. We've got great windows. We've got paid-off solar. Yeah. HOA takes care of the outside and the common area maintenance. Okay. Really a great investment or primary residence if you're looking to get your child in the school district. Yes. I've had the privilege of having my kids go through the Poway School District. I've got four kids to see the elevation and what a good school district can do to their future. I can't put a price on that. No. You could have told me this house was 1.799. No, no, that, that, that Poway School District really is a powerful thing for a kid's future. Yes. Um, and having really four is. beds to get as many kids into that school as possible <laughs> helps. You're right. And uh, not having to pay the price of a, a private school because it's such great schooling. It's unbelievable. It's a really good school district, and I'm, I'm really loving what they're doing with, with, with the schools up there. Um, built great. in the 90s, um, you've got plenty of uh, space, plenty of bedrooms, plenty of parks nearby. And like I said, I'm doing an open house on this one from 2 to 4 and Saturday from 12 to 2. Okay. I don't think it's going to last long. I know the area well, Brandon. Yeah, we should it's see. It's great. Yeah, I know. I'm excited to hear about it. So Brennan's got this property located at 11240 Poblado Road in the Rancho Bernardo 92127 zip code, which, guys, is in the Poway Unified School District. And for all of you that know it, know how fantastic the schooling is. People fight to get into the Unified yeah, School do. District. So four bed, two bath, uh, 1579 square feet of living, a lot of natural light. It's turnkey ready to go. Recessed lighting, which I love. I love, obviously, that backyard and the view that you have mm -hmm. in the back. Huge windows, parks nearby, and paid off solar, which is a huge. huge. I mean, you think about that asset alone, how much just savings you you have just with yep. that paid off solar and your electric it's bills crazy. right now. It's crazy. Wait till the May C start turning on in the next month here. Yes. Right. It's you're it's, gonna be you're gonna love living in this home yep. when you got to start turning on that AC. Yes, ma'am. He's holding it open today between two and four p.m. and Saturday from twelve until two. Yep. I suggest you get out there today because it's not going to last long. But if you'd like some more information, please contact Brandon with the information provided on the screen.